how to add your sense code into WordPress in this step-by-step -step tutorial, guys. I'm going to be showing you how we can do this really, really fast. So if you go into the Google AdSense and you create that you want to merge your Google AdSense into your site, you might be seeing something like this and you might be entering now into panic because what the hell is this? You don't know how to add this into your code. You don't have to worry about that. It's going to be showing you two ways that we can add this into WordPress. The very first thing that you need to do is to go into your actual WordPress. Just focus into the very first method because it's the Google Site Kit. If I go into plugins, I want to choose the option that says add new. Now here into add new, I want to look out for C search plugins and look out for site kit and hit into enter so I can see the site kit by Google and analytics search control at sense speed. I'm going to hit into download and active. Now you might see that behind below the dashboard, we see the site kit. So click in the and we can see now the dashboard of the set guide of the site kit. So what you want to do now is to hit into connect to Google Analytics. It's about all you set up and here want to sign it with my Google account. After you have successfully signed it in, you want to enable all of those options and hit into continue. Now it says have Google verify site ownership. What I want to do is to hit into verify. I want to hit into allow. And here I want to choose the account information below. You can change it later in your settings. You want to choose the setup a new account or create the one that you just created. So I'm going to hit into, okay, I got it. Okay, I got it. And then we're actually good to go. Option number two, which is a little bit more faster than we just did before. What you want to do is go into your Google AdSense and here you want to locate the AdSense code that was generated for you. You want to hit into copy. Now let's go back into WordPress. All right, so now that we are in here, what you want to do is to go into appearance and here you might see that there's a lot of options. I just want to focus into the one that says theme file editor like this. So now that we are in here, you don't have to be panicked about all of this. You just want to look out for theme files and here what I want to do is to look out for the theme header or just the header. Now that you find that, what you want to do is to look out here inside the file content for the option that says head. Here is head number one, and I want to look out for head number two, which in my case appears down in here. So now what I want to do is to into head, and then what I want to do is to paste the code that was provided for me, and then I want to go back. I want to choose request review. Nice work, you completed all the steps. So it was really, really fast. So hopefully you guys was a very strong and useful video for you. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you don't want to see more amazing and easy tools for the Google AdSense and WordPress. Thank you so much for watching the video. See you next time.